Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am here to do some summons for y'all for June the 19th, 2023. Y'all already know should y'all already should know who the individuals are, and if I have to stop, I will. Hebrews chapter 9. Now indeed, even the first covenant have ordainments of divine service and an earthly sanctuary in the Old Testament, you know them. For a tabernacle was prepared. In the first part was the lampstand, the table, and the showbread, which is called the holy place. Okay, so we go out and Gina, I'm not Gina, Shanice supposed to be teaching y'all about her ancestors, which is Gina and them, the Old Testament. She's supposed to be teaching y'all about the Old Testament, the New Testament. Um, after the second view with the tabernacle, which is called the Holy of Holies. Hold on, an app, an a act, an app. Having a gold altar of incense and the Ark of the Covenant overlaid on all sides with gold, in which was a golden pot holding the manna. Aaron's, the first machine, rod that budded in the tablets of the covenant. And above it, she wombum, which is the second machine of glory, overshadowing the mercy seats of which things we can't speak now in detail. Now, these things having been thus prepared, the priests go in continually into the first tabernacle, accomplishing the services. Now, I don't know if, you, if pastors and preachers and ministers were reading, reading the New Testament. I don't know. They say no, but I don't know. But into the second, the high priest, I thought they, I thought they, I thought they were reading out the revelations, yes. But I don't know. But if the preachers and pastors and ministers said no, then they say no, so no. People, yeah, but into the second, the high priest alone, once in the year, not without blood, which he offers for himself and for the elders of the people. The Holy Spirit is indicating this. See, yeah, that, that's talking about me right there, because y'all know I'm saying, you know, when I get mad, I be like, I don't do that for y'all, I do that for me, fuck y'all, blah, blah, blah. That's what they going to, yeah, that's what they saying about me, like, she ain't doing that for y'all, she doing it for her damn self, like, shit, I mean, shit, I am, though, I mean, I am, to be honest, I am, but for y'all, too, if y'all want with the most high, shit. The Holy Spirit is indicating this, that the way into the holy place wasn't yet revealed while the first tabernacle was still standing. Which is a symbol of the present age where gifts and sacrifices are offered that are incapable concerning the conscience of making the worship a perfect. Plus, if I really, I mean, if even if I did want to do this shit just for myself, I would have done did some shit, okay? I would have done did some shit to free myself. Come on now. I, I would have been a dirty motherfucker. Okay, tie is and dirty. First and believe that. I would, yes. Yes. But... I got to do what's right for y'all too. Being only with meats and drinks and various washings, fleshy, fleshy ordainings imposed until a time of reformation. But Messiah, Kia, having come as a high priest of the coming good things through the greater and more perfect tabernacle, not made with hands, that is to say, not of this creation. Plus, have y'all ever watched the things of hair razor? When when the motherfuckers get the box, what they do? They do bad shit with the box. I'm trying to do good shit with this box. So if if if, if I was just thinking about me, even though I do, I mean I am thinking about me though. I'm in the box, but still I'm still telling y'all trying to help y'all. Okay, but still when you get the box. You know, it's it's a gift to get this box, like. I would have been got out, bro. Nor yet through the blood of goats and calves, but through his own blood entered in once for all into the holy place, having obtained eternal redemption. For if the blood of goats and bulls and the ashes of a heifer sprinkling those who have been defiled, sanctified to the cleanness of the flesh, how much more with the blood of Messiah, who through the eternal spirit offered himself without defect to God, cleanse your conscience from dead works to serve the living God. Okay, Shanice, she the living God. For this reason, he is the mediator of a new covenant, since a death has occurred for the, here, has occurred for the redemption of the transgressions that were under the first covenant. That those who have been called may receive the promise of the eternal inheritance. For where 
a last will and testament is, this must of necessity be the death of him who made it. For a will is in force where there has been death, for it is never in force while he who made it lives. Therefore, even the first covenant has not been dedicated without blood. See? For when every commandment had been spoken by Moses to all the people according to the Torah, he took the blood of the calves and the goats with water and scarlet wool and hyssop and sprinkled both the book itself on all the people. My bad, y'all. There's some jumping spiders up in the bed. Look here now. Saying, this is the blood of the covenant which God has commanded you. Moreover, he sprinkled the tabernacle and all the vessels of the ministry in the same way with the blood. According to the Torah, nearly everything is cleansed with blood, the sins. And apart from shedding of blood, there is no remission. It was necessary, therefore, that the copies of the things in the heavens should be cleansed with these. But the heavenly things themselves were better sacrifices than these. For Messiah hasn't entered into holy places made with hands, which are representations of the true, but into heaven itself, now to appear in the prison of God for us. Nor yet that he should offer himself often as the high priest enters into the holy place year by year with blood, not his own. See? They're not killing their own, they're killing us. Or else he must have suffered often since the foundation of the world. But now, that, that could be about me. Yes, I have been suffering. But now, once at the end of the ages, he has been revealed to put away sin by the sacrifice of himself. Ooh, this boss. I, like I always tell y'all, hey, I don't mind dying in... What? What? Oh, I'm finna say. But yes, yeah, y'all. I say I don't mind though, but she, if it happens, it just happens. She, I don't care. In so much as appointed for men to die once and after the judgment, so Messiah also, having been offered once to bear the sins of many, will appear a second time without sin to those who are eagerly waiting for him for salvation. Okay, so that's Hebrews chapter 9. I like the Hebrews too, y'all. But yes, y'all, um... It gon' it, it gonna come to pass what it means, okay? Hopefully y'all enjoy.